share what's what's your name what's your daughter's name and how old is your daughter and what happened to her my name is sandra my daughter's name is cassandra um we had been struggling since uh 2010. give me a second she's here cassandra can i please have you up on the stage really she's quickly so come on let's put our hands together for cassandra we want to see this a miracle girl <laughs> on the stage super shy we call her out it's cool <laughs> you're beautiful thank you so much uh so her name is cassandra and what was uh, what happening with cassandra since 2010 uh, we had been struggling with her having anemia um it was a very stubborn anemia she was on iron and a lot of side effects from that they gave her more medication on top of the the iron that she had um, she'd been not going to school. We, we were about to go to court because that would hinder her from going to school and uh, doing a lot of activities, physical activities. And she's a very outdoor person. She's not a, she's not a sleeper or a social media person. So it, it really hindered her a lot. Mm -hmm. Wow. This is crazy. So eight years she was suffering with anemia, right? And what happened? How did she receive her miracle and healing? Well, we like, We've been coming to church. We went to the conference and we came to the prayer line. We've also been uh, faithfully praying all the time and showing her, you know, that, that God is good. And we kept on praying and praying. And then she's seen another young lady here that had anemia and she was healed also. So that brought her faith even bigger and better for her. So she kept on faithfully praying and eventually she we had a doctor's appointment and she was so happy she just came out cheerful you know and she said i'm healed you know god healed me because the doctor said she was 100 percent healed wow isn't that good so you guys went for a testing to a doctor and he said there is no more uh, sickness right yes no more she's she's healed that is amazing cassandra come over here girl really quickly i want to just ask you so how does this miracle and healing makes you feel what do you what can you do now that you couldn't do before um i can run now for like a mile i think and like without stopping and like when i used to run i, I used to like stop like right away because i couldn't like take it like long runs so yeah so now you can do all the activities in school and the things that you used to do when you were little right yeah that is so amazing come on let us put our hands together for this wonderful miracle Cassandra, we're so happy for you. We're so happy and we believe that the Lord has blessed you and your miracle will and healing remain permanent, okay? And so, uh, Mama, come over here. <laughs> Last one. Would you please share a word of advice to people who might find themselves in a sickness or a child suffering with a sickness? What would you tell them? Prayer. Always keep God first. Always pray. Ask God for a healing because he does hear us and it's it's something that you have to have it continuously in the morning at night when you're at work when you're at home everywhere you go put god first and have a lot of faith and he will hear you he will amen amen thank you so much watching this content i hope this was a blessing to you if you're like me and you like to click on things click on this subscribe to our channel and the content will come to you every time we post it and remember the best is yet to come.